It's time to vote in Tennessee. Hundreds gathered across the mid state to cast their ballots as early voting kicked off today with lines wrapping around several polling locations. Experts are hoping for a better voter turnout this election season. And according to the latest numbers, we have already passed the voting numbers from the first day of early voting in 2016. We have team coverage tonight from right here in Nashville and out in the suburbs in Murray County. Kyle Haran starts us off live in East Nashville. Kyle, you spoke with a lot of voters today. Has the process been smooth? Yeah, most of the voters that we talked to today says the process has been smooth. And it's no, it's no surprise to the election administrator here in Davidson County that the numbers are the highest they've been, especially on the first day. He thinks it's going to be extremely high. Uh, we had some long lines this morning, right? But we talked to some of the people that were standing in line. They said it was actually going pretty well. Well, lines look long at most polling places today. It doesn't necessarily mean it takes a lot of time as social distancing is spreading people out. This woman timed her wait for me 41 minutes at the Bordeaux Library. While there, I ran into a man who says he's never missed an election for the past 50 years. I've been voting since I was 18 years old. The first time I voted was to honor those who had gone before me and made it possible for me to vote. But after that, I voted for myself and my children and his children's children because it is absolutely necessary to get out and vote. People we talked with say the lines, the direction from staff and separation of voters worked well. It was great. I thought it would be a really long line. The directions were great. I mean, that it was very obvious to see where the lines were and where you needed to move. But across town at Edmondson Library, a different story. Busy, long lines, uh, high voter turnout, which I'm, I'm glad to see. Voters reported two hour wait times to vote. This man took the day off to do so. Wanted to get out here early, you know, so I could try to, you know, get it done and still have the remainder of my day. But even if it takes me three, four hours, I'm going to stand in line, you know, no matter what, because it's, it's a very important election. And finally, in East Nashville earlier today, the lines were also long. Every early voting site in Nashville is reporting something like this. And the polls here at YMCA are closed. They close at 430 today. They'll be open until 7 p.m. tomorrow. This is just the first day of early voting. There are 14 total days. And what, we're no what we know is we're expecting this to be a record year. 200,000 people, possibly even more, as compared to back in 2016, when it was 170,000 people that they had during early voting. So expected to be a record year. Reporting live outside YMCA in East Nashville, Kyle Haran, News Channel 5.